Yo, what is going on YouTube? It is OG and today we are back covering some pro gameplay. So um, I'm very tired by the way. We woke up very early for this tournament. Um, but today was South America versus North America World Cup Finals. I don't like know the proper title. But pretty much we played uh, the team that won South America's qualifiers for February, I want to say. Um, so it was Ints, it was Consti, Marcel, and then we do, and I think they have one other person to play. Um, but we're just gonna be like covering the games today, and it was okay. Like I, I know I could have played better in this. There's, oh, make too many. But um, we're gonna get into the brawl ball games at first, and it's on penalty kick. Ray, who doesn't love that? And let's get into the game. Alright guys, so this is my first time watching over the games. Um, so there was so much delay in this set particularly. So I'll break down the delay from our perspective. Um, we had delay the entire Brawl Ball set and then almost the entire Siege set. The last two games we didn't have any delay. Um, in Bounty we had delay and then in Gem Grab we didn't have delay. So it was like going back and forth, but we're going triple tank. Um, so it's a lot to deal with. We can defend really well, but we do get spawn trapped. Um, they have like the barley and the gene, so we don't want to give them like too much value. He should pull there. I, th I think he should. Um, that's okay though. So they all have like gadgets. Obviously, gadgets are in play for this one. I'm still getting used. To this was <laughs> my first time pretty much using the prank gadget, so I just throw it on there because I don't want to get stunned up by the bear. And Greg did a good roll though. I, I probably didn't need to use it there. Um, I'm gonna look for the barley and like I said, just try not to judge my prank too much because there was delay and like. Frank with delay is very annoying, um, but he's still he's still broken right now. Like I feel like I had to use him, so I played him like a good amount with delay. Uh, so right here, they're gonna like butcher that pretty bad. Um, that should have been a goal, but we're gonna hang on and they kind of just int, so we just get mid control and we can. We're in a really good spot right now, actually. So <sighs> again, I'm not used to like gadgets. I guess I was within range of the gene one. Um, and here it's like looking pretty good for us. We do have position, Bobby did go down, but we'll just like kind of like hang around and I just want to get my super, I'll get pulled though. So it's kind of even right now, Crying's just like holding down mid and we do have the grass in mid, which is really nice. Um, we're to see of Rosa, of course, but Bobby's gonna put out some more grass for us. And when we get to overtime, like honestly, I like our comp better in overtime, I think. Like the barley is kind of, He's not useless, but um, he's not as good. If Crank can get roll, and like, especially if we have supers for overtime. If we have supers for overtime, like, I think we're in a really good spot. So he'll use, I'm pretty sure that's the last of this gadget on me. He might have one more, not sure. Uh, but the bear is like 1v1ing me. <laughs> I'm gonna go down. I do manage to take first down with me. Um, so one for one, not too bad. But no, it, it's kind of awkward in that situation for a Frank. Bobby's gonna pop his shield. He doesn't really get any value. Um, he probably should have saved this for overtime, so we had triple super. But he will actually take out the barley up there, but he'll get taken out too. Um, right here, I think we can definitely score, especially I stun him up. And Crying gets pulled, and he just auto-aims the ball. Um, to be fair to Crying, there's delay, but if there's no delay, he 100% could have scored like left corner there. Um, so, a little unlucky, and then here I'm yelling to Crying, like, I have right side, like, go left. And he just... He, I thought he got like pulled, but he got faked out, so he should have like watched left more and trust me, right? But that's okay. Uh, we'll lose game number one. All right, so game number two, um, we're getting off triple tank, <laughs> and it's it's not a bad comp with delay. I don't know. It's like iffy because you feed a lot, and I don't think this is the best map for it to be honest, just because there's so much stuff like hide behind. It's hard to like overwhelm them, especially, and it's really easy to get spawn trapped, and you can like a lot of supers. So I'm on. Um, Mr. P against Barley, and I'm playing it pretty poorly so far. Usually I can like tie, um, but I did miss a few of my shots. Still, we're all getting used to the delay at this point. So Bobby's gonna pick up his super, Crying's gonna pick up his super too. Um, and then I'll just try taking out the Nita, that way he can't score. But if I go up, uh, I thought Bobby would save it. So I thought he would save it so I could just stay back so I can beat the Barley. But I could have saved that if I went up, so that's 100% my fault. I just miscalculated it i guess um it looked like bobby saved it too it was like on the line but it sucks <laughs> so uh they're off to a really good start right now and i'll get my penguin out finally i'll like push him back with the supercharged penguin but it's not gonna do too too much bobby's gonna hit a really good pull actually and that's gonna 
give us some breathing room. That way we can just kind of like push out a little bit. I'll get my supercharged penguin up, but it doesn't do anything. Um, so waste the gadget. The gadget, it's like, I just use it to get like back people up mainly. And sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. So I haven't like figured out like the perfect way to use it, but it's like extra pressure, I guess. So it's not like a complete waste. Um, but Bobby's like playing pretty good so far. He's hitting his pulls and crying does have a super two. So right now we should 100% score. Um, and I think we do score here. I'm pretty sure. Um, Bobby should pull him, yeah, and then kind of mess the pass up. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I remember we're just like, yeah, just walk it in, walk it in. Like, we just like completely like feed the Nita like zero to like 100 super. Um, but it, <laughs> I mean, there, there was so much delay. Like, we just, we just wanted the goal. So it didn't like matter too, too much, I guess. Like, obviously, you don't want to feed when you're scoring, but we just wanted to get the ball in the net. <laughs> um, so we gotta like pick up on the gene there. So I'll like catch the gene out. He uh, ran it down a little bit there. And we're in a really good spot again because now um, we have mid control and we have their wall broken. And I'm gonna supercharge my penguin here just because I know when we won the parley. So let the penguin get the solo kill. He's still going. He wants the Nita. Um, fortunately, he will get taken out. So we're in a really good spot right now as long as nobody gets pulled. So we just gotta like kind of wait it out and we do have my penguin set up. So they're slowly coming up and that'll like take a bit of their attention, but they're gonna try pushing it up, which um, I don't know if I do right now. Well, he, he should just go for a pull, honestly. That's like the best way they'll get out of this. Um, so I kind of, I want my penguins to be more active, um, but they're just gonna pinch over and gonna let us kind of like move up the left side though. And Bobby catches Consti out and we can score here 100 percent so marcel does have pull but he's gonna pull crying um and we just gotta like be patient because crying did pick up his super so i'll take out we do and it's just like wide open at this point so really nice pull from bobby or from crying and good shot from bobby in between them and we'll take the second game all right guys game number three so um we're gonna switch i'm gonna go on barley this game because barley is very strong here and mr p is like really good but i prefer barley with delay than mr p with delay um so I'm gonna have that Barley Mirror matchup and um, they will get early position, but you can just see he's like feeding my super. He's like not really playing it as well as he could be. He doesn't need to give me any of this value pretty much. So I'm just gonna like not like, I gotta avoid the gene pull here, but I also wanna chip the gene down. So that way they can't be like so aggro and I'm really close to my Barley super. So I'll pick it up way before him and I'll catch the gene out here, I think. So I'll take out, how does that not hit? Okay. <laughs> I was gonna say I'll take out the gene and that's gonna give us like mid control and we can just kind of like move up So now I gotta like spike back for some positioning on the barley um, Crying's just like looking to build up his super at this point in the game and I'm trading like decently with the barley crying He's gonna miss his pull unfortunately um, if there wasn't delay I think he would have got it, but we're still getting used to the delay and Tara's like pretty sus with delay so it's and sorry, I don't mean to like keep like bring up delay as an excuse um, but it's just kind of unfortunate to deal with. Um, but I'm still thankful we got the opportunity to play against them. So I'm kind of in their spawn. Like, I'll just take out Consti and not take them out. But I just want to apply, like, a lot of pressure. And just because I have really good positioning right now. So I'll just, I'll force out the pull here at least. Um, I think, maybe? Yeah. So I get a pretty good super off too. Bobby's going to pull him out of my super. But we get the kill. That's all that matters. Um, and they're slowly going to start, like, pushing up. But I think we'll be fine as long as, like, Brian can get his super soon. Um, Marcel's going to whiff his pull. Fortunate for them. It was an easy auto in pull. Um, but it's kind of like a stalemate right now. Bobby's going to hit a really good pull. He he played really well today on Gene, and Crying is going to get his pull good, good too. Um, but I think they spawn in in time. Yeah, so we got to, like, we can just spawn trap here, honestly. I, I have my super. And we do get like too ambitious though, and we just get punished for it. So I want to like keep them back in their spawn. I'm getting really good value here, but um, we did overextend there, and that's going to cost us position. But um, we just want to get like set up for overtime. So Bobby's going to pull Consi, and that'll give Crying a super. Crying's going to pull Marcel, and we're looking like really good here. But the G knockback is just so strong, um, and. You know, they're getting so much value so i'm gonna super the ball just so we can like potentially like move it up and like score there it ends up just baiting out his super so it was a really good super and bobby good job faking it out and bobby almost like knocks marcel back into 
uh, my path. So I almost like, he almost stops it, but I'll sneak it by him and we'll take game number two or three. All right guys, game number four. So if we win this, we do take the first set and I finally get to go on spike. I was, my teammates were skeptical, but I was like convincing them. Like we thought they were going to switch comps, to be honest. They, that's one, one reason, one thing that they did really wrong. They rarely switched comps and we picked up on that later, but I'll get to that when I get to it. Um, so we're gonna lose the right side pretty badly and that pull um is gonna be kind of tough i'll manage to corner it but you can just see i was like because i have a mismatch too like barley is supposed to like really beat spike but i'm like doing okay on my side and i almost get consti um one more spike connected i would have got him but he has the healing star power which definitely is like the hard counter to spike um so we just got to be careful here and just kind of like wait it out a little bit. Um, I'm getting some pretty good value on Spike and Bobby's going to knock him back. Bobby's going to pull Consi, which is really good for us. Um, Crying is going to get taken out. Unfortunately, he needed to like super there. Um, so I'll get pulled and then they will get the pull. Um, but again, Barley has super, so I kind of have to like be a little more passive, but he's not going to like choose to use it on my side. If I was him, I might just use it on my side and just like run through it. But I can just like kind of like poke him down with my RNG. It's not going to do much. Karin's going to get a good solo pull there and take out the Nita. Um, but Bobby, can you kill? I think I, yeah. So I get some good RNGs and I'll take him out too. Um, but I'm going to look, I think I get kind of greedy here and I go for the Barley. I'm pretty sure that's what happens. Bobby's going to pull uh, their Nita, which is a nice pull. Karin is super, so he should just pull, yeah. And then we should be able to score here. I was like yelling for the ball, I think, but um, it wasn't like a for sure goal, but I could have got like a pretty good shot. Bobby has pull, so he has to look for it. Nice, good pull from Bobby. Um, he's been, like I said, he played a really good gene today overall, just not even in brawl ball. He was like hitting a lot of his pulls. Crying's in a waste is super, and I think that really hurt us. Um, that's one thing with this map. You like, honestly, ugh, I'll get pulled there too. It's unfortunate, but you... You get greedy and then you lose positioning. I really dislike this map so much. Um, it's just so awkward to play on and it's so crowded, but um, I think Brian didn't really get any value on his super there and we're just gonna get like really backed up now, but the ball is, oh yeah, we're down a goal. <laughs> so <laughs> I think we should have been like a little more patient. Sorry, I'm really tired. Um, I got like three hours of sleep last night, but I think that super kind of lost us that one. All right guys, game number five. So I'm back on Barley. Um, I think, I honestly think I played fine on Spike and if, I think the strat would have been me go Spike and Crying goes Barley or something like that because um, the Tara hasn't been too, too great for us so far in the set, but they're gonna lose right side again um, and they'll get pushed back pretty fast, but I'm getting a lot more value than Consti is. So I'm way closer to my super right now. So I'm gonna look to just like, because I really want to, I'm being aggro here so I can get my super and just like push them back right side because they're up really high. So that's why I'm just kind of like forgetting about my side. But Bobby's going to get a really good pull on Ince Marcel. His name was Nova Marcel for a long time. Um, and that's going to enable us to just like move up a little bit. So um, I am really close to my super. I'll pick it up there actually. And I think I throw it like right side. So they're going to miss their gene pull really big for us and get some decent value there i guess um it kind of just spaces them out but we get like pushed back by their barley super two at that point so nothing really really like comes from it but bobby's gonna get another good pull and then crying is gonna miss his pull unfortunately uh he really rushed that there's you don't even need to solo pull that i think um so all like the work that he's been doing to get his like pull of this game is just like down the drain at this point but i'm like doing a good job keeping them spawn trapped um and I'm getting pushed back by the bear a little bit, but they won't get much value. So Bobby is going to look for a pull on Guido here, I think. He should, maybe? No. Crying almost takes out Guido, actually. He really overextends there and gives Crying so much uh, value. So he's probably like halfway to his pull at this point. Um, Bobby and Guido, they're both looking to do the same thing. And Bobby does come out on top. Also, look on. See, I'm like yelling for the ball. I'm like crying, ball, ball, ball. If he passed me the ball, instead of focusing on killing Nova Marcel there, I could have scored. 100%. Um, so that's kind of unlucky, but he focused on like the kill like way more. If he just passed the ball, I would have scored there. Um, so we're going to lose complete positioning because of that. But crying does get to super at least. Um, and we're really pushed back though. So crying needs to get a good pull or something. And 
Um, it's just not looking too good. We're getting like I'm stuck in the corner. I got my super, but we have like 15 seconds to make something happen, and we honestly could just because the walls are broken and we all have supers. So I'm gonna look to just like run up and like use my super. Crying's gonna solo pull, and Bobby really rushes it though. I think like the play there, you pass the ball and then pull, so it goes through him, and then Crying gets the ball and you can like walk it in or something. But there's like that's like the perfect play, and like we had so much delay. So it's like it like wouldn't happen, but I think that would be the only way we could score there. So it's not like Bobby's fault or anything. Um, but just a rough game. We 100% should have played Spike instead of Tara. Like just watching over. Okay, guys, game number one of Siege, and we're going back for the triple uh, tank. It's actually really strong in Siege. So we just want to get all the bolts, pretty much. We don't really care about giving up too much value. Bobby's gonna put his grass down in middle. I'm back on Frank, and there's still so much delay. But I'm actually getting really good value right now. So I'll go down here, but as long as we get the bolts, that's like all that really matters. Um, unfortunately, Nova Marcel will get that one from us, but we're off to a really good start. We get the first robot, which is huge with this comp, by the way. Um, and then we kind of have like, I guess they want to go all in here, but like I don't really want to go all in because just watch like, watch it from my side. From their side, it looks like it's wide open, but from my side, like the bot's already at like 30%. I can't run through and like, I just like think to back off um maybe we should have gone all in but i don't know i think if we just like held there and like we could have got all the bolts pretty much because they don't have high dps comp that can push us out and i almost take out the daryl and i think i missed the mr p here yeah so i missed the mr p um i don't know like i understand it from theirs but we wouldn't have finished there and we had complete mid control and we have so much HP and it's such a good setup, like I had my super and everything. So I really think we should have held there, like even just watching it over again. Um, but they're gonna get the second robot and we do have really, really good defense though. And we're tied in bolts right now, which is actually fine. So Bobby's gonna pick it up. We gotta watch out on Nova Marcel a little bit. I think I get my super here. He'll take me out with the gadget. <laughs> um, but they're getting like pretty good damage. So they're gonna get it down to 46% and we just need to get the bolt. So we're gonna make some plays happen. I'm like, he's my gadget. I think he's gonna, cause you have to remember we have to lay. So I know he's gonna roll there. And like, I try like predicting it. And I just, <laughs> that like, uh, that kind of like, if I hit that, we would have won, I think, but I missed it. So we didn't, but, um, oh, spoiler by the way. But <laughs> it like, if I didn't have so much delay, I wouldn't like have to try to predict it, but they're gonna get the robot, so the only way we could win here is if like Crying gets a super, which good. Um, but it's a pretty like it's level seven, it's not that strong. But they're uh, just kind of like spinning a bit, and that's okay. Like I don't, I don't take spin. All right, game number two of Siege, and we're going back with the triple tank because we had like the long talk, and we're like, okay, we know what went wrong, and like um, we kind of like just talked about it, which was like. They wanted me to fully commit, but I stand behind me not committing there. Like, they saw it from their perspective, I saw it from mine. But, it's okay. <laughs> I won't dwell on it too much. Um, but we are gonna just, like, kind of run through and get, like, all the bolts again at first. So they don't have a really high, like, DPS comp. So, um, Marcel's gonna roll in and give me my super two. So, I think we almost get it too. Um, kind of close, but... Here, we took out their Daryl really early, so it's really good for us. And they do have the Porter on defense, but I think Marcel should have probably like rolled towards me. I'm just gonna tank it up a little bit so the bot stays alive, and I'll back off. Um, that way, we, Bobby can take it off. So we just like pass the aggro, and we just like literally like beat them. And they wanted to do that last game, but the situation was different because the Daryl, like, they did way more damage to the bot at first, and just how the, it was set up like this time i was on an open lane and like i think i would have died last game if i went for it not even like from the knockback because i have my gadget but it's the dps and everything um so you can kind of see like just how broken triple tank is and it's such an easy comp to use it's a joke all right guys game number three so we're thinking we just have to like switch it up because we think that they'll like counter us and they go spike but i think triple tank still would have been fine even against it so i'm on spike this game and Ponzi's on spike. Well, I got the spike matchup, but Bobby's gonna kind of give him super. <laughs> Not like, like, Bobby's kind of playing what he has to, I guess, but, um, and it's very unfortunate because 
I don't know. Like, I'm playing this so bad just watching. Like, not even, like, he does get super, like, way before me. And I should have died there. I got, like, a lucky regen. I'm just playing this so bad. Like, I think part of it, I had, like, three hours of sleep. And, because I usually fall asleep at, like, four. And, like, I got up at eight. Because, I don't know. I wanted to, like, try waking up and, like, working out and stuff before. But we're, like, pretty much getting one push almost. Um, so they get, like, really, really good damage. And they have mid control and they have the bolts. Um, but hopefully, like, because there's a lot more of these finals, I guess, but they're for, like, region locked. On. But I'll, like, actually get my side back here. I don't know why he backed out so much. But, um, hopefully the next ones aren't at 10 a.m. Because that's not really <laughs> good for me. Um, I'm trying to be aggro so I can get that bolt, but I know, like, Bobby's gonna get it. It's too late, though, and they already had, like, it wouldn't have mattered because they had an extra one. I gotta like pinch over here and then I will throw my super down and try to get my gadget off because Spike's gadget is just so good on defense and um, but it doesn't matter they don't even need the robot at this point so they're just gonna like roll in and beat us. <laughs> Alright guys and this is the game where we actually get the server so this was kind of like we get the server and crying's just testing it he's so happy right now in VC he's like oh my god I can shoot and you, they don't, they have delay this game, by the way. So we've had delay the entire, like, series up until this point, and they got it right now. So you can just see, like, how, like, we're really dominant right now. Also, Bobby's on Gene. So these are, like, comfort picks for us. Besides, like, Barley, anyone can play Barley. It's such a simple brawler. So Bobby's going to get a really good pull there, and we'll get the first robot. And um, we just kind of, Marcel's going to roll in there, but Bobby's going to use his gadget. And we get, like, we've played this really well so far. And we just have really good control and everything. Um, so I'll get my super off on the safe. Bobby's gonna pull the Daryl out of the way. Crying's just gonna roll in. I'm gonna go for some damage, but we do want mid control. So we'll actually get out the Gene super. So he, he, I don't know. I understand why Gene super there, but Gene super is really big for control. So I'll just like zone them off now. And Bobby's gonna hit another really good pull. And I feel like they needed the Gene super to kind of like get back into mid. So by them not having it, Bobby is gonna like be pulling like right when he started his. That was because he had the shield but um you can just see like the impact of delay and no delay like we like dominated this game i feel like um there wasn't really much errors on our side and it was just so refreshing because we really needed to win uh win this game um otherwise we would second set right so i'm just gonna get like some chip down on the safe i can i know i can finish at this point so i'm telling bobby just like body block for me Gadget, and we'll just like take them out. We had like mirror comps that game, and it was just like really straightforward for us, I feel like. All right, guys, game number five. Now, this one is for the Siege set win. Um, so again, we didn't have delay this game. We're like celebrating right now. Because uh, the last game was really straightforward for us, I think, and we're looking to do the same thing again. So they're gonna like double up my side, which I don't really understand because it's just gonna, I have AoE damage, right? So they can't really do much against me besides speed um and they did put the mr p on the first bolt which kind of weird too so we're gonna actually collect all like the first four uh round bolts we won't get them off in time we'll have three but it's just we're like off to you can't get off to a better start than this for us so bobby's gonna hit his pulls and i'm just gonna have like a free side and i'll go for as much damage as i can but we don't want to get too greedy so i'm probably crying just chill like you can just spawn trap them and Bobby has pull. I can just like zone comps. Yeah, so I'm gonna be really aggro here. Even if a bolt like spawns behind me, like I'm not gonna go for it right away because my priority is keeping him out of lane and like just giving him making his like time as tough as possible. So you can see, um, I'm just cutting him back as I should, and he's like pretty much useless at this point unless like I mess up. So I'll just like dodge a shot and go for a kill there. And um, we haven't given them a single bolt this game. So we're looking to finish here 100%. Um, I'm just gonna like, I got my super up on safe too, just because I figured like he's gonna try doing the same thing and I can just get like my super back. And I'll just like kind of run at him and take him out. Um, and right now Bobby needs to protect me a little bit. I think they gave up at this point. Uh, I don't know why, like, I don't think I'd give up, but um, I'm just gonna go in there and finish it off with one of my shots and just, we really dominated that game. Like the last two games, we didn't have delay. It was uh, really one-sided for us, I think. But we'll take the siege set. Okay, so for Lair Kick, 
I just want to take full credit for coming up with this comp. I really like this comp. Um, and <laughs> Bobby just he usually never does anything, so he's very thrilled about this comp. Um, he, okay, I mean, he, he doesn't do anything on this map usually, just because he's usually like Brock Lane and it's just like ticks and pipers and everything. But this comp revolves specifically around Bobby's super. Um, so I'm like literally like just support and like I have to hold my lane and get like some mines, but we're just using me for my turret pretty much. And you can just see it like we want to break open the mid. So Bobby probably should have gone for mid there instead of like pick, but that's fine. Um, we do, we did get that early kill. And also we did have like delay and bounty. Um, it wasn't as bad as like, maybe it's just like the fact that I'm on bow, but the frank delay, I was like shooting backwards in game. So that was like, that was pretty annoying to deal with, but he's so good. Like, I feel like you have to play him even if it's like that. Um, so Bobby's gonna hit a really good shot on Marcel. He's definitely overextending there, um, but Bobby will make him punish for it. And then just need to like break open that kind of like middle grass there. So we can like always, we want to keep an eye on the Piper. Like if any of us get solo killed and it's not by the Piper, then it's pretty bad. So I'll like solo kill Marcel, but the Piper's there to clean me out. That's why we needed to break that middle grass like really earlier. Um, Bobby's gonna super and he'll get the Porter like pretty low, which it's not a bad super, but that grass where he's standing in, because that's literally his star power. That's like what we need to target um, with Bobby's supers. So I just like put my turret in the back and even when like Bobby's regening, like fine. So I found out that Mr. P's penguins are very annoying for bow mines. <laughs> And you'll see later in the set, one of them literally like jukes it, so he like trips on my mind. It's really funny, but um, pretty much I didn't like I got that one solo kill, but and then I got taken out by the piper. But as long as I don't die here, it's really close actually, um, and really close. We almost get Marcel too, to be fair. But I just had to like juke there at the end a little bit and like hide in corner. But uh, this comp revolves around Brock Super, so. <laughs> All right guys, game number two, um, and you can see like again, they're not switching comps really. I think they've done like one slight variation in their comp this entire like match so far. So we like really picked up on it and we're like not too worried about them switching comps. Like if they do switch comps, then we can adapt to it. But right now we're like just kind of assuming that they're gonna use the same thing and we definitely like our comp over theirs. So I'm getting a really good value already and I'll trap we do and Bobby's gonna pay ask me, but that's okay. Um, but. We almost get the Piper too, um, so he really overextended there, and they will get my turret, and I really want to get my mines down, so I can just kind of, I'm just spinning in the circle on board, <laughs> it's not the end, but he'll uh, supercharge his penguin there, and it's just, uh, it actually took out the turret, that was, that was such a good penguin, 18 HP, like I knew I almost got him, uh, so kind of unlucky there, I'm catching him like overextending, this matchup's like really in his favor by the way, I think. Um, but I'm catching him like overextending he's getting way too greedy and he'll use another supercharged penguin But it's not really gonna do much. Um, I'll just take it out. He should focus more on like Saving it for the end of games. I think just in case they get backed up But Bobby's gonna take so you notice that he took out the grass and really good super from Bobby there, too He'll take out mr. P, but we can just track the piper so easily now now I'll get Consti with my mind and I'll just clip him too and crying's gonna get him too with one Big thing, so if I didn't clip him there, I think he would have survived like slightly. Maybe Crying could have got him with another mine, but um, you know, it was a good thing that I clipped him, I think, just to be safe. So I'm actually like considering him on bow, I'm kind of like putting in work this game. But we do is in like a there's no walls left. <laughs> this is like this is what we wanted, so I gotta be careful. I have to juke that on by going under the suitcase just because I'm really low. Crying's gonna overextend though, and he'll get taken out. And look at it, it like literally jukes, so it like takes out my mind, it gets both of them. <laughs> And that's good. Like, they could push down my lane if they wanted to, but I'm, like, playing aggro right now because I know, like, if they kill me, like, it doesn't matter. Like, Bobby has five stars, not me. So I just want to, like, push them back. And I'll get him at the end just to improve my KD a little bit. But um, we're going to pretty... Well, yeah, it was pretty dominant, I guess, the second game. All right, guys, game number three. So if we win this, we do sweep the bounty set 3 nothing. Um, So we know they're going to stick with their comp, but they switch it up. They put the tick on my side this time. And we're just kind of like hanging back. So if I'm Consti and like, yeah, so he's going to go straight for my turret and I almost get him here. I, oh, actually Bobby gets him. But I think I get taken out. Unfortunately, I like just step on the mine and I almost get their Piper too. Um, but that trade's like good for us because we've got Midstar and Midstar, it's pretty much free star that like doesn't stay on you. So it doesn't add to your like kill streak or your stars, whatever you want to call it. But I'm like, 
I don't know. If I was like playing the tick in this matchup, I would be so much more aggro against like the bow and just like really have them push back. So Krang's doing a good job on the other side. I haven't been focusing on Krang at all this entire thing. <laughs> He's just kind of like there. I feel like tick's kind of like boring to commentate on when it's not like the center of attention. Bobby's going to overextend though and he'll get taken out by the Piper. So one thing that's really notable is they still have all their middle grass, right? And remember, the point of our comp is to get rid of that middle grass and make the Piper like kind of obsolete. Um, but Bobby's gonna pick up his super here and he should, if I'm Bobby, I'm just supering that middle grass so I can like always track and I will tag him and I'm gonna go for the kill there, but I don't know. I don't know why he's super there. <laughs> like crying has position and like, that's such a bad super. Oh my gosh, I, that's my first time seeing it. He should have just super the middle grass. Crying at like full position and like, I don't know what he was even going for. The takes like in their base. I overextend too, because I'm not sure where the Piper is. And uh, so that's my bad for overextending, but that middle grass really needs to go. It's going to the comp. Um, we all have supers now pretty much though. And they're playing really like, if I'm them, I'm spawn trapping us right now and not letting us like even get a chance to push up. But they're like literally just letting me like walk down the side like freely. Um, so I do have my mines and he'll use a super trick penguin and I'll throw my mines to the left corner just because we want to focus on the same person and Piper is going to jump and my, uh, it would have connected. We would have team wiped there probably, but, um, I would have got a kill. There's like 0.2 more seconds, but it's okay. We made so many misplays that game and just, we played that so poorly. So even like if we did have delay, like we should have won that one hundred percent. Same with Brawl Ball. Alright guys, game number four, um, so I picked up on their tick going on my side, so I'm just gonna throw the turret to the other side, that way, like, it's nice for me, but I don't wanna, like, I have limited turrets, right, so I don't want them all gone really early on, and they're actually, like, looking to put Piper down lane, but Crying is just gonna, they put the Piper down the wrong lane, because Crying just sits there, and, like, the Piper can't hit him, so they rotate it down my lane, I didn't know they rotated it, that's kind of funny to watch, um, but yeah, the Piper should've came down my lane right away if they were trying to do something like that, and they're gonna, oh, Bobby, that was free kill. I won't get too mad at him because he did get the grass, so it's not it's not too bad. That was kind of free kill. Um, and we'll just kind of like push up here as well. I wanna get my mines just so I can start doing more, but at least we know like where the Piper is now because of the grass, so we can track her a lot easier. Brian's gonna get his ticket out. It's gonna take out the tick's grass as well, which even though the tick head didn't get any value, like just destroying their grass is really important. Um, I think a lot of people overlook it. So Bobby's just, <laughs> getting his super and they're gonna look to take out i don't think they should even like focus on it too much unless the tick can get it like for free but it's kind of like i've only used one this game and i'll juke under the suitcase so that's gonna because he doesn't get the hitbox i know i have to juke here so luckily i just dodged the piper shot otherwise i would have um, taken out and we would have been down i don't know why the, well okay i guess they got the grass so that's fine but um we're only down one nothing and i think we're in a really good spot so bobby's gonna push the tick back and he's gonna use his gadget really well, so I don't know if that's the best Brock super, um, just because of the gadget, but that's okay. Well, um, I think we, we might get the Piper here. So I'm gonna get caught out, and the Piper is gonna like get too greedy and look for a kill on me, and Bobby's gonna be there with two really good Brock shots. Figure out, and the Penguin is actually pretty good at taking out my turret. I didn't like realize that. So here we just need to like hang on. So I'm putting my minds where like playing really defensive and. Seven seconds, no reason to go out there. No reason, Bobby, no reason at all. Bobby is just gonna run it down and we had the, <laughs> that was a free win. Uh, he wanted to, like, I don't understand, just watching that back, that's so, <laughs> uh, that's us, Bobby. <laughs> all right guys, game number five. Um, So we've literally like thrown the past two games so hard. It's like, it honestly like kind of triggers me. Like I threw one, I think, and then, well, I don't think that one was completely on me, but I did like get caught out at the end. And then that last game was sus. <laughs> um, but Bobby's just gonna like, you guys understand what we try to do with this comp. So Crying's even gonna get some charges too, uh, because why not? So we'll just be like a happy team in our bow mine. So I don't want them to get mid star, so I'm gonna focus here a little on mid, I think. And Bobby, that yeah, we talked about like just breaking the grass and gonna do a good job just break the grass so i do have my minds i'm just gonna make sure that they can't get that mid star with it like obviously they can trigger it out but we do want to catch them over extending like that's how bobby got his kill last game he got really greedy so i'm hoping he might get greedy for the mid star and just try breaking those mines and bobby can get good value so bobby's gonna hit a shot there and the piper like 
As long as we can track the Piper, I'm not too, too worried about it, because then if we get, like, caught out, it's just us being stupid. Um, but we know, like, we knew how important this game was, so Bobby's gonna get his super back really good there. And he's hitting, like, a lot of shots really well, and I'll just connect that one bow shot, <laughs> the one that got through, like, right out of the Piper. So, really good coordination for me and Bobby there. Um, he's playing really good so far this game. All his supers have been exactly where they need to be, and he almost three taps Piper there, which is really good. I, like... I feel like commenting, like, when I, like, commentate, I just focus on, like, usually, like, mid and, like, wherever I am. Um, and then, Brian's side of the map is just so boring to watch. Like, I'm trying to watch it right now. Um, he'll, he'll get his ticket out, but on the other end of the thing, me and Bobby are getting kind of pushed back, and he almost gets Guido there, so I'm just gonna, like, drop it there. Um, and not really the best place, but it doesn't matter. There's, like, 10 seconds left, so we're just gonna zone them out, and I'm, like... Bobby, do not go up. <laughs> do not go up. Um, so he'll safely use his super this game, and he'll jump for the first time. I think he could have survived if he jumped last game, maybe. But um, we'll take the last game, like, pretty convincingly. All right, guys. Set number four is gem grab stone four. I'm so happy because I get to play a brawler that I can kind of, like, pop off on here. Um, the rest of them, I was playing, like, kind of... Not support, but I don't know. Just not, like... I really like playing like Penny and Spike right now and like I got to play Spike twice but it's against a Barley so I can't like pop off against a Barley lane. If I had the other lane I would have popped off I think. But pretty much I get to play Pam and we didn't have delay this this gem grab set we didn't have it at all. So they had delay um, so unlucky for them but it's been like pretty much even I think because we can have it in Brawl Ball we did have it or sorry we had it in Brawl Ball most of Siege and then Downy we also had it. So, um, I don't know, like, it sucks that it's a factor, but I'm gonna, like, just kind of read Ponzi here, and I know, like, he's not gonna, like, check lane, he's gonna want to, like, regen, so I, like, kind of, like, that into account, and, um, I'm telling Bobby just focus on Crying's lane, because my lane's, like, one already, um, so he's gonna have, like, the Pam healing star power from her shots, which is better for trades, but you can just see, I really like the turret damage one, it, like, literally just soloed his turret, it's so fire, um, and... Be good for the penny one too but um you can see i'm just applying like a lot of pressure on my lane and i'm looking to flank them here so they know i'm here um but on the other end of thing nova marcel is <sighs> I keep calling him nova marcel Marcel's gonna get a good crow super in and um just kind of take down his side so Brian's gonna use his gadget here just so we can get a rough idea where they are and we're in a really good spot right now we have gene pull if anything for when they get greedy for a gem so we're looking kind of to do that i don't want to lose my lane so just backing off so I can regen in peace, and then he's gonna like check lane, I think, and he'll just clip me with one shot. Otherwise, I could have been sneaky there again. Um, and that's like a lot of what this lane is, it's just like being sneaky and like out trading. So I noticed that like I have the Pam push back and then crying at super, so I'm like, okay, like just cover me, like I'm gonna walk in. I'm I'm Pam, like they can't kill me like right away. So I just walk in and grab two gems, and Bobby's gonna hit his pull there and kind of solidify the victory a little bit so we pretty much again i didn't focus on crying's lane <laughs> but um it was a pretty straightforward game for us all right game number two and they're gonna go with mr p mid which actually it's not a bad mid at all and it's actually really good against my pam turrets and you can see like i i don't know i wasn't playing my best today by any means and I think I was just like still asleep, <laughs> to be honest, like I'm still like so asleep and just like tired. Um, Konsi is gonna, he, I forget what he did, he out traded me at first, like, he like waited for me to use some of my shots, so I'm just like trying to get my turret up and like give it to my teammates, but I forget like they have Mr. P, so when I do get my turret up, they like take it out pretty easily, so if I had the like shooting star power, I'd want to shoot the pink one right away, but I don't, so I just want to like regen a little first, and I'll just like play it back here, but Mr. P, like I forgot about it, um, so that's misplay for me. Um, I mean, Pam turrets, you get them pretty often, and they're not, like, usually game-changing, but they're definitely, like, good for just um, kind of maintaining your lane, I guess. And most of the action's on the other side. So I'm going to, like, sneak by here, and I think they pick up on me. The penguin catches me. The penguin catches me. I was, I had a good flank, and <laughs> if I had my Pam turret here, I could outplay, and I'm really close to getting it. So unfortunately, I, I die right before I get it. Um, so I couldn't do any, like, anything fancy there. But, um, my teammates have done, like, and there's this penguin glitch where you can't see its HP. It looks like it's immortal. Um, it was, like, tripping us out in-game. But 
My teammates have done a really good job just on their lane. Crying's had Gene lane, which is really annoying. Ponzi overextends, so I'll take him out there. And by him overextending, that's gonna let like crying. So you can see he switched to the star power with the damage turret. And I'll throw my like Pam turret just not directly against the wall. That way, um, that way, like the Mr. P can't just hit it whenever he wants. So I don't really care if it gets taken out there. I just really want to keep some pressure in my lane and I noticed that they're getting like really close here so I think I go pretty aggro again so he just catches me out with one um and I'll get my turret and I think I just kind of like throw it towards them so I'll also pop my regen so Bobby gets it too uh, my gadget regen that is and then it's not nine right now Bobby's gonna miss his pull so Crying does have pull though, which biggest threat in the game. Crying's just gonna solo up Consti, and I know I can just like run at it and get it because of them. <laughs> so we do did miss his pull recently too. So we knew like we had like a bit of time before he got it because he's getting some good value, but it's not like anything big. So I was just like keeping my turret to see if I could like bait him into <laughs> because I knew they had delay this time because we had like it was like perfect for us. Um, so I wanted to like try baiting him into like pulling my turret just for like the meme, but. He didn't um and i just dropped it so we'll take game number two all right guys this could potentially be the last one it is a best of five and every game if you guys haven't picked up is best of five every map's best of five too so they're gonna go with the same comp i really like tara here i think they should have gone with tara it's such a threat when you get your super you could see last game it's the impact that it had bobby's just gonna hang on oh close bobby um and i'm gonna win my lane have Consti push back and I'll bait out his shot so that way he doesn't regen. I'm telling Bobby like yo leave my lane alone like I don't want you here go help crying <laughs> and I kind of like I don't know I just really like playing Pam lane here it's fun. Pam in general like I really like when she's not mid and you can just be like super aggro and just like kind of make plays and just I don't know just kind of like YOLO so I'll like I think I go kind of all out here maybe no I back off because I see um they kind of have position but then Consti overextends so i'm like okay if he's gonna like go for my turret like the turret doesn't it's not that important so i just like go for a team wipe kind of um and i really want the team wipe but we do uh, i'm like yeah let me get the team wipe <laughs> but we do just runs away and i'm like beating him super at this point so i'm like okay like just like come back and take him out together bobby um so bobby will use a super and he'll pull him like i mean there's nothing he can do at this point like he's kind of just iso and Bobby's gonna miss his pull, and we will take the final gem grab one and win the series three to one. Anyways, guys, that is gonna be it for today. Um, GG's to Ants, they played pretty well. Um, but yeah, I'm not too happy with how I played today. I feel like like delay is sus, but you could, we 100 could have won. We could have won every set. Well, okay, every game. Every game was so winnable. Brawl Ball, we should have won. It was just, like, stupid mistakes. Um, and then the Siege games, like, that miscommunication. And we did beat them, like, a good amount when we had Delay, too. It's just annoying to deal with, I guess. But I don't know. I don't want to keep talking about Delay. Anyways, um, so I'm really happy, though, because we got a decent, like, prize pool. I think it's, like, 9,000 US dollars. And then the thing that I'm really happy about is the points towards the World Cup qualifier. So all I want to do is qualify for the World Cup. That's like, all I'm focused on. Um, much brawl stars wise just making it world cup i like it hurts me to stay home or, or like go and like watch on the stage it's like painful um so i don't want to ever do that again just watch from the crowd it's not fun <laughs> but uh luckily we did manage to take this one and yeah that is going to be it for today's video i hope you all enjoyed the gameplay and i'll see you all tomorrow peace